special to do you know I said I always have things to do on a Saturday I don't have anything special to do today but I want to go and get my snacks from um member kappa hygiene I don't forget sorry I want to get my snacks from Dollar Tree I want to go to Rue 21 and Ross to have a look at their um what is it called now? Okay, Rue 21 for their perfume and Ross for um, uh, my brain. Don't fall down on me. Um, sorry, the exit gate. Um, for, what am I thinking about? For, for um, skincare products. The other day I was in there and I saw something that had gold in it. I'm like, oh, gold. So, um, I want to go and have a look at that. This is the song I like again. Nothing in the world can stop you now. Hey, 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 hey. Nothing in this world can stop you now. Hey. Nothing in this world can stop you now. Hey, hey. Nothing in this world can stop you now. Blazing. Too much brutality. Hey, hey. Oh, I'm telling you. That song keeps coming on. God knows I like it. Nothing in the world can stop you. Um, so yeah, I just want to show you the, what I do this weekend, come along with me, it's Sophisticated K weekend, just good vibes, you know, positivity, and I never put in my top ear what I do, but I don't do it very often, and whenever I do the first couple of minutes and stuff, it irritates me. Did you know that I had eight piercings? I've got my ears pierced four times. That's a sophisticated K fact. Go, 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 go. Sorry, I didn't want to um, wait at the traffic light again. Did that person come for? Oh, they did. <laughs> Worse than me. <laughs> oh my gosh. People are so annoying though. They see that the light changes and they take forever to go. They just take forever. Like, keep your eyes open. We're driving here. They're supposed to be moving forward. So when you see a green light, go. And that applies to life as well. When you see there's an opportunity, go for it. Don't sit there and wait. Look, what can you see? What can you see? Can you see the red light? As soon as you see a red light, there's obviously a reason why you have to stop, right? And in the Bible, it says, be still and know that I am God. But when there's a green light, go 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 full force into your purpose go forward and achieve and you know live out your dreams be successful don't stop on anyone's account because people are doing what they want to do in life don't let them stop you so go okay go and that's one thing that i i like about myself i don't let anyone stop me oh look here it is stop you I don't let anyone stop me like especially when it comes to don't go because I want to change lane right especially when it comes to my books my photography my YouTube like I don't want anything to stop me I don't want anyone to stop me because I've got to achieve what I have to achieve in my lifetime I've only got one life to live can you stay in your lane 
That's another thing. Why does driving hold so much messages? It's funny because my book, Messages of Purpose in Life, right? I put little um I put little stories about my life in the book, things that I feel like helped me find my purpose and um two of them the two of them yeah i think two of them applied to um experiences from when i was from about driving but it's so true because driving is like a major part of my life and a lot of people's and so you can relate to things that you experience as a driver some some people that people that don't drive can't always understand The perspective of a driver so um yeah i think that's that's it's a big deal but anyway i'm almost there look i also want to go into there can you see it i want to go into there because the funny thing is it's k-a-y k or kai whatever they call it k jawless kai no i think it's a k so um I've always wanted to get a ring from there because of the name of the shop. There's no spaces close by. That's the only thing about Saturday. Are you coming out? Whoa. If only I could show you how this person parked. Are you coming out? Are you staying in? Are you living there? Okay, I think you're coming out. If only I could show you how she parked. Wow. Girl, that was terrible. Mm 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 mm. I'm um, gonna head in and I'm gonna show you as much as I can the fashion and the skin products and the snacks and stuff that I get. Cause yeah, because of my diet, I can't eat a lot of stuff. So I have to like compensate with like cookies over here because everything here has milk, butter, cream egg this that and the other and i'm like seriously you don't cater for kaisha you're mean anyway let's go so as soon as i walked in i was greeted by a guy and he said oh, you got some perfume oh my God, that's exactly what i came in here for so um, he gave me four little samples not bad oh I like that actually oh and I think Nikima would like that oh oh although I'm not too um, big on everyone knowing what's in my handbag even though I did that video to tell you what was in my handbag <laughs> that is funny that's cute but I don't know if I could wear that Here we go again, everyone knowing what's in your handbag. No, I do not want to wear, wear weed prints, but anyway, some people like that kind of thing. I just walked in here and look at what I've seen already. Oh my goodness, why does this happen to me? This is where I got my um, white ones from. I don't know if I've shown you them. I don't need no firming creams. So where has the section gone that I'm looking for with all the really good... Oh, one minute, here's some. Look at this body oil with tea rose, jasmine and forget-me-nots in it. I am a big fan of like natural oils and stuff. They haven't got the thing that I was talking about. 
Oh look, this has gold in it. But this is just a one-time thing. Five masks. I want the actual bottle with it all in. So I'm kissing my teeth right now because I missed it. Probably because my skin's so sensitive, so I didn't want to get it just on the whim and then I use it and then I break out, but I was thinking about it. Oh well. So I'm looking at baby things because my twin cousin is having a baby girl and I'm so excited. While I'm here, I'm gonna have the biggest shopping spree of my life. Oh my goodness. I went to the cinema the other day and I got... Where are they? Oh, here they are. Okay, off to see my family in the barber shop. Okay, so I'm home and I can show you properly but I also have to clean everything because I don't know if you guys have been following me since 2015. Have you been a subscriber since 2015? Comment below if you have, right? Because that means you would have seen my... What did I call it? I think I called it I Clean That. Or something. I don't even know. It's been, it's been four years. But, um... Every time I go shopping, I come back and I um, I clean everything before I put before I put it away, before I put it in the fridge, before I put it in the tear in the paper, before I put it in the fridge, before I put it in the um, in the pantry and in the cupboard and stuff. Because I don't know what's on people's hands. I need to make sure that when I go and get a can of tuna or a jar of pasta sauce, that it's clean already. So, um, yeah, I clean everything and then I pack it away and so I, uh, I have to do that. But anyway, I will show you the stuff that I've got. So, I'm a pescatarian and when I'm in America, it's really difficult to find things that I can eat when it comes to snacks, but also when it comes to like things for lunch. So. Thank God, praise the Lord for Dollar Tree because I found these veggie burgers. There's two in a pack and it's amazing because I can literally have one, have some fries and things and then that's my lunch. So I got two of those. I also found these vegetable spring rolls and there's 10 in there. And because I get really full quickly, I have about five and um, it's so funny, right? I have to show you one day, I have a squirt of mustard honey mustard and I I dip it in the mustard and then I wrap it in, in spinach and because the spinach leaves are as big as my hand I can literally wrap the whole spring roll in the spinach and eat it oh my gosh I love it so that's that in England right I can't have custard cream that's what they're called in England but these are called lemon creams right I can't have custard creams in England because I think it's got milk in it or something like that. So um, when I came over here and I found these, I'm like, oh, thank you, Lord, I can have these. Okay, and who else has to open it, right? And have one side and then have the other. Oh my gosh, I have to do that. Right, I also like um, Pringles, right? I normally get the barbecue one. I had a, I've got a video of that as well. I'm gonna put all the videos that you can catch up on. If you haven't seen them, then I'm gonna put the slides, right? They're gonna come towards my face like that. So, I like Pringles, the barbecue flavor, because it's not hot, right? But they don't have, they don't have that over here. They have an awful lot of other flavors for Pringles. They don't have that. So I get stacks and I get this one because this one doesn't have any milk and whatever in it. Um, 
just the original flavor and it's kind of salty so i literally only have like four at a time so it lasts me a long time i don't want high blood pressure okay and then like i said i went to the cinema the other day and i bought this to go in i know i broke the rule but kaisha breaks the rule wherever i go i break rules not not breaking the law but breaking rules that i don't feel like i can get in trouble for and go to prison over so i took these into the cinema and um i like them like i like barbecue so that's barbecue and then honey buns i have been in love with honey buns i'm a honey bunista i'm a honey bun lover i'm a whatever you can use to create a name that's what i am since 2008 when i went to texas i got one from a a vending machine and oh my gosh oh my gosh um i put them in the microwave for 10 seconds and let me tell you this right i don't use a microwave for anything else but i have to have these warm so um after i eat dinner and i'm like oh that was so good but i need something sweet that's what i do i warm it up and that is my late night snack all right so I went into Rue 21 to get perfume and it's so funny how uh, as soon as I walked in the guy came over to me he's giving me um, little sample sticks things and he and the woman said to me do you like coconut and I'm like yeah I like I like coconut so um I didn't get lush I got black instead and this can fit in my handbag Woo! finally my goodness and you know it's funny because i said to him is it for is it a male fragrance he's like no but i'm like just the fact that it's called black and it looks like this makes it oh gosh oh gosh it no actually i feel like this should be a male fragrance right and then funnily enough i got some underwear right this is called Boogie Girl, right? But it's funny because I remember back in the day a style of underwear like this and I called them bum huggers. Oh my goodness, they are so comfortable. So I got some of these. And this says all the feels. I'm not gonna show you all of them because um, it's a little bit, you know, strange showing your underwear. Yeah, it is, isn't it? But I just thought I'd show you that. I like these, this, this style of underwear. They're so comfortable and because they're stretchy, like look at that. So anyway, I'm gonna relax now in the house for the rest of the evening. And then tomorrow I'm going to church. So um, stay tuned. Oh my God.